Hey, we are in Palm Springs. We're here for Coachella, and uh, we'll be vlogging today. But unfortunately, it's kind of hard to have like real camera access in there. So I'm going to be counting mostly on an iPhone 7. There we go. How's that? Looks good. Sounds okay. All right. So let's uh, music festival. Cactus Garden. So we're here with H&M. We're shooting a ton of outfits. I'm kind of sick. Honey's kind of sick too. But we've got a lot of work done so far. I think we have uh, 5,000 photos from yesterday. And here's what we've been doing today. For a bit of behind the scenes of the photography, how I've been doing this is shooting everything in both RAW and JPEG so that the CR2 files are available later for high quality stuff, but we also have JPEGs to download to the computer right away and we can sort through those for Instagram. It takes up too much time to shoot for both Instagram and the blog at the same time, so we're just doing it once on one camera. And I could use the Wi-Fi and the 5D Mark IV, but it eats up battery life and a lot more time. Carrying this computer around all day is a bit of a pain, but it makes things much faster to actually choose the final photos, see them full screen, do a quick edit, fun job. Also, vlogging with an iPhone is so convenient, but I really wish I had a proper microphone, especially when it is so loud, because I assume you can barely hear me right now. But I'm going to NAB next week. I want to take a look at the Shure and the Rode iPhone mics. They go directly into the lightning port and give you like pretty good audio. That could make the iPhone a little more of a viable blogging platform. The trend I find really surprising this year is all the glitter beards. It's a new invention. Some tips for anybody thinking of uh, attending Coachella. Don't think you're gonna see all the bands that you wanna see, because you're not gonna see half of them. Just choose one or two important ones and go see those. Okay, something else that's important to know about Coachella is that you can't actually bring any cameras in that don't have. So unless you have the appropriate photo credentials, you can't bring a bigger camera in. Security loves to remind you of this a lot. So I think there's tricks that you could do, like have a non-detachable lens that still looks good, like uh, like a Q or a Canon G7X. Something with pretty big zoom would be helpful too. Then you can shoot the artists on stage. Yeah, just don't bother coming in with a big camera because you're gonna get fought at security and so worth it. One person yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah. The people that come from the music. Oh, I'd love Weekend to talk about two. That. Weekend one is all about the fashion and the photos. Weekend two is all about the music. We're here for weekend one. <laughs> Look at those pants. I've been switching between iPhones and Androids a lot this week, and it's become impossible to remember how to switch to selfie mode or switch camera modes because they're all completely different. Day two on our way home. We're gonna get up at 5 a.m., 4 a.m., 3 a.m. We're gonna get up at sunrise. Much before sunrise. And uh, shoot some photos. So we miss all the concerts, but it's, it's worth it. It's 5.30 a.m. Sun is not quite up yet. But we uh, better hurry if we want to shoot photos before it is. Here a few minutes later than we hoped because the first location was closed, which is not what the website said was going to happen. So hopefully it's not too late in the summers. I think we're not too late for this to look awesome. I 
This looks pretty good. Surprisingly, we're the only people shooting blog photos here. Everyone else is just a photo club. Okay, that shoot was pretty successful, even though we missed the uh, missed the perfect light. And now we're at this awesome installation. Where, I don't know, can you see this? If you line up just right. So, do I win a prize if I line up all these billboards? This is where we were supposed to be shooting earlier. Can you just imagine how nice this would be in the sunrise? Okay, I have a request for everybody out there. If you are being a tourist, like I am right now, and hanging out in a public space, please don't wear a neon pink or green or yellow or purple shirt because you ruin everybody's photo. <laughs> Unless it's really cool. I don't know. I mean, you can wear colors if it's interesting, but if you're just wearing a t-shirt or a tracksuit, just keep it boring. Try to dis just try to blend in. This is what we have to compete with by not getting here for some reason. Okay, this is how you should dress if you're a tourist. Blend right in. Now we are at the Ace and we're gonna go see the artist speak about his work. Our schedule's been kind of weird today. Turns out the artist was not speaking at the Ace Hotel this weekend, that was last weekend. So we came home, started editing photos. Here's a quick preview of what was going on today. So far, I uh, haven't been to Coachella Grounds yet. But that's okay, because things start pretty late in the day here at Coachella. So uh, we're gonna go and check things out now. And if you look outside, so you'll be lining up for buses. All right, we have arrived through a secret back entrance that apparently we're not supposed to be in. Oh yeah, so I may not have explained properly yet. The reason we're here is to shoot photos with H&M of the collection. They do this capsule collection for Coachella. And so Anya has styled a bunch of looks with it and we are taking photos of all those looks and they've also set up an amazing on-site installation that uh, I'm gonna show you right now. Okay, I'm gonna give you a really rapid fire tour of the H&M tent. Sometimes 7200, sometimes 100 to 400. And then on the other hand, it'd have like a 16 to 35 or a 17 to 40. And for shooting musicians on stage, having that two camera setup is incredibly useful. So, but I'm kind of glad I don't have to have two cameras here. I have a really simple setup. And tragically, my lens hood actually broke on the way here. That's why I don't have it on, otherwise I would. I also just realized how much less wide the non-selfie cam is. This is a lot wider, isn't it? Better for my face. Oh, <laughs> 
video. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Perfect. well, I can do that too. Okay, so that's the end of Coachella. Anya, what did we learn? Um, there's for sure some lessons in there. <laughs> <laughs> Where sandals, despite of what people say, um, I want my feet to be... Cool. Cool. I'm still not gonna wear sandals. Layers, bring a lot of layers. That's a good tip. Um, for the night. Oh yeah, like and pack a jacket so that you can put it on, drink lots of water. I learned that if you're vlogging with an iPhone, you should use the selfie cam more. Even though it's not as good, it's a lot wider and it's kind of worth it. And I you wish can I was, see what you're doing. Yeah, I, was, I wish I was doing that the whole time. Also, a real microphone helps. This was year two for us. Hopefully it'll be year three. It was so good. You might not think it from like how it's The current state right of now. affairs. Because we're really, really tired. Smoking is permitted in designated areas only. Please refrain from smoking while walking throughout